Hey guys, tonight we're going to be doing Horror from the Deep quest for my third quest of the night. Uh, to complete this quest, I need level 35 agility, 13 or higher magic would be an advantage, and also you have to defeat strong level 100 enemies. Uh, level 40 prayer is optional, and it will help you a lot versus the mother, Dagonoth. You need Barkrawl mini quests that can be completed just over here at Barbarian Outpost and also you need one fire rune, one earth rune, one water rune, one air rune, a sword that you do not, are you willing to lose, that you're willing to lose, one arrow that you're willing to lose, molten glass, just one, one tinder box, one hammer, 60 steel nails, two normal planks and one swamp tar. We can start this quest by talking to Larissa. With what? But how can I help? Also, having multiple uh, multiple spells will help you defeat the boss a lot sooner you can do it with one combat style but it's going to take you a lot longer and you'll have to sustain through a lot a lot more of the fights how can i fix the bridge where is your cousin i'll see what i can do so we're going to run down here and fix the bridge Oh, sorry. Okay, we're gonna go back to Barbarian Outpost. You can use your games, Nicholas, if you want. I'm just gonna use it because it's a bit faster than going over that death trap agility uh, obstacle. So we're gonna go in the, the Barbarian Outpost. This is why you need to do it because. Yeah, they decided to put the NPC inside the Barbarian Outpost. Happens to be Larissa's brother, I think. And he should just be right over here. Yep, Gunthorn. Gunjorn. So talk to him. You're going to ask for the key. He gives you a lighthouse key. Easy. Now we're going to have to repair the bridge that Larissa was talking about in the first place so we're going to go straight back over so this is easily easily doable with 13 prayer uh, 13 magic but it's just uh take you a bit longer obviously because you won't hit as much and especially if you have one defense it's going to take you a bit longer as well you're gonna get hit um there are safe spots but you'll still get ranged um just don't be close enough to get attacked by its melee form and you should be fine now we go down here which is east from larissa i'm not going to talk to this guy because there's no point um we have to do is go down here nearly out of run already really got to train that up Sadly, they made it so far away. So even though you use both your planks on it, it doesn't really change the appearance of it. I think it just gives it a rail. So you do that, and then you... If I can cross it... We pass it on the other side. doesn't really fix it like when you look at it <laughs> it's not really fixed all right now we go back to larissa and basically say we fixed the bridge blah 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 and yeah simple so we just run back to larissa and it's a pretty short 
pretty short quest. We've only probably got another five minutes in this quest and we're done. But, you know, I don't need to do it since I'm an Iron Man. The book doesn't really matter. I don't have pages yet, but I have a few pages. I have basically one of each page. So I'm just going to pick up a random book. I don't, I don't really care because, yeah, I'll probably just use it for churning later. So we talked to Larissa. Got the key. She's in here now. First, go up here, search the bookcase. Get the lighthouse manual. And the ancient diary. Flick through both of these. Basically it tells you how to repair a, a lighthouse. A uh, light. So, blah, blah, blah. Skip through the diary real quick. Jeez. Fingers in well. Got the ladder. Now we have to use them on this light mechanic. We have to use Swamp Tar. Tinterbox. Molten Glass. And that's now we have to go down to the bottom because we got the lighthouse working. It's all good. And we get on the iron ladder. We go over to here. We use our ear rune, earth rune, water rune, fire rune. Error. Sword. Should work. Yep. Talk to Joseph. A Dagonoff will come out of the water. It's a baby Dagonoff, so this is the first easy fight. Just Yeah. So once you're basically up to fighting, you've basically done the quest already, you just have to kill the bosses and you're done. Uh, really simple, easy quest for pures to do. Only takes around 10 minutes to do, depending on how long the fight takes. See, I didn't even bring food because this account basically you shouldn't need food, I shouldn't die. And you'll think it's the last one, and uh, it basically tells you that's the baby, uh, the mother is here. You basically just cast them from your spell book. Blue. I think this is orange. Is it either orange or brown? Or is it red? Is this brown now? Okay, this is brown. <laughs> that was I wasn't sure if that was mealy or what. They look so similar similar. Similar. Uh Kill it, there we are. We completed the quest. Like I said, really easy quest. 
Uh, to get your prayer book, we just go up this, go up this ladder. Go up the ladder again. Basically, it will tell you which book you want to pick. So, okay, guys, be careful what you pick. So, currently, I think the cheapest book is Sarah Dolman. The dearest book by far is Zamorok. So, really think that you cannot buy a book. You have to complete, uh, like, the whole book before you buy another one. So, if you buy the Zamorok, you have to complete the whole book. Like, fill it up fully before you buy a Sarah Dolman one. And then you have to fill that up before you buy a Gothic one. So, basically, think that through when... Yeah, basically, think about that when you're picking your uh, book. Because if you're on the poorer side, it's going to take you a while to... I think it costs about 8 mil to f fill up a Zamorak book. So, yeah. Again, thanks for watching, guys. If you need any quests done, comment below, and I'll try and make a guide for you.